It's been a dark Tuesday for French football, with dozens of arrests and raids over possible corruption and match fixing. Caen and Nîmes officials are suspected of fixing a Ligue 2 game last season, allowing Nîmes to avoid relegation. The presidents of the two clubs were among several officials taken into custody on Tuesday. The French league president said the clubs could be expelled from the league should the allegations be proven. If these suspicions are confirmed, this will be an extremely serious case for French football, for the professional league which organizes the championships, and for myself. Corruption, or even the mere suspicion of corruption, or match fixing, are a lethal poison for our sport and for sport in general. About 20 years ago, French football had already been rocked by a match-fixing scandal involving the Southern Club of Marseille. The club, currently at the top of Ligue 1, is back in the spotlight, this time regarding suspicious transfers. Marseille's current president, as well as two of his predecessors, were taken into custody and grilled by the police. At the heart of the probe is this player, star striker André Pierre Gignac. Investigators are trying to determine whether his transfer from Toulouse came with illicit commissions.